I'm a Holy Ghost worshiper, and I am first partaker of the fruit. Holy Ghost of God in the earth today. Holy Ghost of God in the earth today. The Holy Ghost is God in the earth today, and you walk with Him by saying words. My name is Andrew Hemstraw. Thank you for joining us. If this is your first time here, make sure you subscribe. If this isn't your first time here and these messages are blessing you, then consider becoming a partner with us. I have a message that's both unique and valuable. And if you can hear it, you can have it. Second Timothy chapter 2 verse 6 the husbandman that labors must be first partaker of the fruit here it says you have to be must be first partaker well i do these things i live these things i partake of these things say i partake of these things here on these social media platforms it's a numbers game that we're all forced to play and those who succeed know their audience and many will create what they call an avatar of the person they're trying to reach an avatar being a fictitious person that has the right age and the right demographics the right income this is the person that they're trying to reach and I've come to create such an avatar and I realize that that person is me people like me that want more of God they want to know him and how to walk with him as God in the earth today those are my people I am the avatar say that I am the avatar it's you Luke 4 verse 8 says thou shalt worship the Lord thy God and him only shalt thou serve well I have come to know who the Lord my God is he is the Holy Ghost he's the only God in the earth today and I've learned how to serve him this has become my religion worshiping the Lord my God and him only serving people that do this these are my people but so often more and more especially recently I hear this they don't worship me they don't worship me they don't worship me I can walk into a building and hear that they don't worship the Holy Ghost I can hear it use of those words I worship you Holy Ghost will change you it will completely transform you from one thing to another from this to that those words create a space where you are totally transformed from one thing to another say from one thing to another Jesus said he would send another many have not been transformed from the one thing to another but these words will completely transform you to another I worship you Holy Ghost I am selling total transformation not just partial transformation listen not just partial transformation and so many people may begin down this road of worshiping the Holy Ghost and speaking some in agreement with his word and they're experiencing maybe partial transformation it won't cut it I'm creating Holy Ghost worshipers people who know the living God the Holy Ghost as God in the earth today and walk with him by speaking words they worship him they are my people there is a living God 
and he gives us richly all things to enjoy because I say so Psalms 91 2 says I will say of the Lord he is my say that I will say of the Lord he is my and then it goes on to say the things that he will do verse 3 says surely he shall deliver thee when shall he surely deliver thee when you say of the Lord he is my his said word delivers his said word heals his said word renews your youth his said word prospers you his said word creates a new reality for you to move into and for you to live in his said word his said word most people go from one problem to the next problem and in the midst of that they're all God help me help me with a solution to my problem is that you you are being led by the problem and you're expecting God to just follow after you and your problem this is not living this is having problems and being under the problem and having God try to come into your situation and fix your problem no you need to flip it in fact you must flip it and the circumstances follow you that's flipping it before you're oh the problem God the problem no you create a new reality to move into and then the circumstances and situation follows you you haven't said the word enough to flip it to where the situation and the circumstance follows you did you hear that I am called to make you a Holy Ghost worshiper ah but but there's no such thing as a Holy Ghost worshiper I make it a thing my words make it a thing my worship makes it a thing I speak therefore I am I create the space to live in I am a Holy Ghost worshiper that's not a thing my mere existence makes it a thing I speak therefore I am I'm a Holy Ghost worshiper and I am first partaker of the fruit thereof I know the Holy Ghost as God I worship him as God and I walk with him as the living God in the earth today by speaking in agreement with his words and I'm completely transformed because of it transformed from this to that from one thing to the another thing John chapter 4 verse 4 says God is a spirit and they that worship him they that worship him i am a they that worship him i exist they that worship him are my people i know my audience i'm one of them i hear it i do it i live it and i eat the fruit of it say i eat the fruit of it is it good fruit mm, yeah it's real good fruit the best fruit I've ever had and I've been around for a while I've got a new Bible it's different now other preachers who don't go here meaning don't worship the Living God the Holy Ghost God in the earth today their voice is tinny sounding to me because they don't go here I can hear it that they don't worship the Holy Ghost but I can't go back there I've been removed from it to another are you here 
i walk with the living god by worshiping him and speaking in agreement with his word his spoken word out my mouth is healing his spoken word out my mouth is life proverbs 4 20 says his word is life to me for i have found it his word is health and medicine to all my flesh his spoken word is life to me his spoken word out my mouth is healing to my flesh is wealth to my finances is youth renewal to my physical body his spoken word in fact i'll often ask this question to members and partners what word are you saying what word are you moving into i am that i am that what that word said that's what i am and have you said it enough listen have you said it enough to lead and flip the situation so that it follows you the situation changes to follow you i speak proverbs 10:22 the blessing of the lord makes me rich and adds no sorrow with it i am made rich no sorrow added i've flipped the situation the circumstances follow me i make it a thing i speak therefore i am you speak therefore you are thank you holy ghost we worship you we thank you that these things are a living reality in our life and the situation flipped and the circumstances begin to follow us instead of us being under the circumstance or following the situation it is happening now i thank you for it holy ghost you are the living god we worship you and walk with you by speaking your words those words are life to us and we have found it in Jesus name amen if you have a tithe or an offering hold it in your hands say this after me Holy Ghost I worship you I thank you that you're God in the earth today and I walk with you by speaking specific words and those specific words change my circumstance change my situation so that i'm not following it or being behind but they're following me for i am the head and not the tail above only and not beneath in jesus name amen jesus at his right